Naomi, what is the soul's job? The soul's job is to remind you who you are and then choose who you want to be. Naomi, I heard there's no judgment in what we call the afterlife. We will not even be allowed to judge ourselves. Is this true? There will be no judgment in the afterlife. There will be opportunity to look again at all that you have thought, said, and done here, and to decide if that is what you would choose again, based on who you say you are, and who you want to be. In order to be ourselves, is to choose what we love to do? That's right. Do what you really love to do. Do nothing else. We have so little time. How can we waste a moment doing something for a living we don't really like to do? What kind of a living is that? That is not a living, that is a dying. But, but, if I say I have others who depend on me, little mouths to feed, a spouse who is looking to me. If you insist that your life is about what your body is doing, you do not understand why you came here. At least do something that pleases you, that speaks of who you are. The actions of the body were meant to be reflections of a state of being, not attempts to attain a state of being. So can I say one does not do something in order to be happy, one is happy to something? That is a perfect statement. The soul's decision precedes the body's action in a highly conscious person. Only an unconscious person attempts to produce a state of the soul through something the body is doing. This means our life is not about what our body is doing. Our body is doing is a reflection of what our life is about. This is another divine dichotomy. We have a right to our joy. Children or no children. Spouse or no spouse. Make a lot of money or don't make. If they're not joyful, then release them with love and let them seek their joy. Yes, because our life work is a statement of who we are. 